Righty, so a few weeks back I said the domestic cat was nature's asshole, but you know what? I was wrong. Well, cats are dodgy, but they're nowhere near as bad as a swooping fucking magpie. I'm not even joking. Look at this bird, ready to consume your mortal soul, looking for eyeballs to poke out like Toby Green from GWS. They sit up on power lines acquiring targets and bam, flying out of trees, taking on entire families. We're struggling to reduce carbon emissions because none of us want to ride bloody bikes down here. The evening news puts out apocalyptic maps. It's like being in Command and Conquer Red Alert 2. Oh, this wombat testicle I ripped out is tasty. A bit salty, but tasty. It's in the eyes. You can just tell this guy is a shithead. He hears a human and off he goes. I'm going to get you once. I'm going to get you twice. And just when you think I'm done, I'm going to get you a third time. Like their cat cousins, they don't discriminate. How you going, dog? Fuck you. Oddly placed pelican? Screw you. Much scarier looking bird? No worries. Piss off. And Piss off. Double swoop. The postman, fuck you. Why are you delivering junk mail? You're meant to bring legitimate mail. Actually, could you check if you have my Amazon package under the name Maggie Smith? It should be a vial of worm-flavoured vaping juice. Oh, and I also ordered a jar of Belle Delphine's bath water. Using a fast mode of transport doesn't save you. These little two-toned bastards can still catch up to you. Let's look at me split screen. Sweet Swift, relentless strikes to the head. At least he's wearing a helmet. Unlike this galah going in without protection. Oh, fuck off, you fucking slut! <laughs> oh, you fucking fuck! Idiot! <laughs> Look, I'm going to blame the victim. He just shouldn't be outside in spring. I stay inside for two to three months every spring. I develop mental health issues, but a personality disorder is better than a magpie attack. This Sheila is onto something quiet, crafty, using a piece of tree as a prevention method. It looks like it works. Oh no, it doesn't. The fucking magpie is going to be extra angry now. The piece of crap camouflage has fallen off. The Maggie is like, you think you can trick me? That tactic might work on a drop bear, but it's not going to work on me, lady. You're a goner. Look at this one, lulling a puppy into a false sense of security. Oi, mate, I'm your buddy. You've got a friend in me. Nah, I'm not scratching and biting your face and body. Yum, this peg is tasty. Hey, what are you doing? Me? Nothing. I'm definitely not sizing up your lower intestine, imagining it decorating the nest in which I'll raise my brood into the next generation of merciless killers. Nah, not doing that. Wait, I hear something. Cunt bird away. Now again, I'm not trying to paint in broad strokes. Hashtag not all magpies. I'm sure some are being naturally defensive of their homes. They're not inherently evil. Okay, this magpie is flying away with puppy intestines in its beak. So yeah, this one is evil. Confirmed asshole.